Hey guys, I'm Cole here, today I'm watching Legends of Tomorrow Season 6, Episode 6. Last time was a pretty fun episode, it was the Satanist and Prince episode, did some crazy stuff with turning into animation that only Legends can do. Like, there's not many shows that can do that. So yeah, overall, it's been a pretty fun season to watch. My favorite episode is probably still the Cuban Missile Crisis one, because I feel like that one reminded me the most of like Season 3, and that's been my favourite Legend season, and I feel like that one reminded me of that, so that's my favourite episode of the season so far. So yeah, we'll see what's in store for this episode. I prefer to jump into the episode if you do like this video, maybe consider subscribing because as you can see here, only 6% of my viewers are actually subscribed. So if you like the video, maybe consider subscribing because it'd really help the channel out. I'd really appreciate that. But yeah, without further ado, I'm just going to get started on the episode. How? You'll never guess in a billion years. Okay, well. Oh. No, but I, I was going to say that would be my first guess. It's like the Wait, that's the Wave Rider. Is Mick here? Not my fault you couldn't keep up. I can only hold two glasses at a time, unlike you. <laughs> with your tentacle fins. Smart. Let's go find my ship. Then we find Sarah. I didn't think it was going to get here already. He's watching them. Amelia Earhart. The dog. Whoa. What the hell is this, eh? Oh, the anti-alien security system. You know those greenies are going to try to make a move on us here. We'll be ready. Oh, that's what took my tea then, is it? No, sorry, sir, they make a good skincare treatment. Oh. No, I got these. Poor guy wants a cup of... See, names and nomenclature... He's brought him inside. ...same organism, living and breathing as one. So, I'm also... Errol Trozzi. Everyone... <laughs> ...and they aren't. Oh, I hate getting this new face. It's creepy. Speaking purely as a house guest, is bringing a rampaging alien back to John's house something we should run by him first? Probably. Oh, I'd be. I'd kick them all out if I was from. I couldn't stand it. Couldn't have it. What was that one Legends episode where doing the sanitary? Was it? It was season three, wasn't it? Constant. It was a constant episode before Constantine was part of the show. It was the Arctic Universe snart. He was gonna get what, like a um, Welcome. Checking in your wife? lobotomy, the and casting the Sarah hooked no, up. That was a great episode. Is there a reason it still says special appearance by Matt Ryan? Like he's been part of the show for for a long time now. Oh, okay. So that's who stole the ship. Yes. <laughs> Is this Kayla? Oh, oh, Gary. I've not seen Gary in a few episodes. It's Gary. Oh, I want to see it. Okay, keep it calm and friendly. We're gonna go check out the pod. It's not a pod. It's the wave rider, right? Now all I need is a distraction. Oh, I forgot Gary and Kayla know each other. Idiot. Then do I hear wedding bell? <laughs> <laughs> I've got I've got a bit of my rift that like, goes down a bit. I always do that. What you've done here, it is astonishing. And I didn't want to Is this gonna work? Couldn't have said it better myself. I love this new turn of events. I love it too. Does this actually work? <laughs> Ava, you, Ava, you know she, she knows she, you know she massacred the town. How do you think she did that? Oh, here we go. Bloody hell. Nice job, Ava. Hey, look where I'd go. Oh, shit. There is a spell I used in an uncooperative person to rip a memory they didn't wish. Oh, but can John do it now anymore? I've only done it on humans, though. Okay, fine. But oh. We'll do it back at the wave rider. Like can he? Help Is it gonna work? Got the greatest magic tutor in the world. So, all right. So she can do the magic, and he tells her how to do it. Why don't you just handle it yourself, John? Yeah. No offense, Astro, but if this can go badly, I'd rather the expert do it, John. Nope. No danger. None at all. Why is he not telling them? How else is Astro gonna learn anyway? Ah, <sighs> God. Right? 
there's times like this I miss watching Stephen and Lois in that show he would just tell them he, he wouldn't keep it a secret from them for, for literally no reason mind. also I hope John doesn't have his magic gun for too long oh 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 that's horrifying ah oh, Jesus what the fuck is that Looks like Bowser from the Mario movie. Suckers. <laughs> Every time I hear someone say suckers, I think of Mortal Kombat Annihilation. The suckers! Is this Gary? Or Kayla? Wait a minute. You're that thing that ate D-Squad. Oh yeah, it's Gary. Let's get him. Stop! He's a hero. <laughs> what? Have a great servant like you. Gary's living his dreams right now. <laughs> Not even remotely true, you know. I am in complete command. Why is he lying to them? Can't have everyone in this world and below knowing that I'm just. Oh, okay. Well, now it makes sense. Really yeah. I loved it in the episode of Legends, but it really felt like the Constantine show, like the tone of that show, because I actually really dread that show. Sucker. Why is everyone saying suck at this episode? <laughs> oh. Everyone's weird every day. He's our each legends. I modified my pain receptors. I wasn't born yesterday, you know. <laughs> well, actually, technically, I was born yesterday. <laughs> you get my meaning. So, yeah, if you don't kill him, then he won't come back, oh, right? Oh, exciting. I just keep him held somewhere. Nope, this next one. Oh, this is a machine that he comes back from. No one's ever accused me of being smart. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> oh! Yeah. Yeah. Every scar on my body is a memory. A lesson that I learned from blood. Does she have any? And it's what makes I swear, we've never really seen any of her scars. I don't think. I don't forget any of it. That, there was that actually there's that one episode in Arrow Season 2 actually, I remember, where her, Diggle and Oliver, which one all discuss. Well, Sarah, I don't see any scars on you. Yeah. Oh, oh shit. Did she die? Holy shit. Sarah's a clone? No? Did you wish Sarah died? Yo, holy shit. Well, god damn. Well, that's a pretty huge ending, right? I mean, Sarah's dead? Like, the actual Sarah? That's huge. I wonder... So, okay, so either he's lying, like, that's just a fake body, we've still got the original Sarah. Or, that's a clone Sarah, we keep clone Sarah. Or, the original Sarah comes back somehow. Because that's huge. And also, like, we know, like, in the Arrowverse, that, like... I don't think a clone's exactly the same, like, because the whole thing with, like, bringing Sarah back, back in Arrow, like, Constantine had to go to hell to get her soul, and, like, that's what they've acknowledged in Legends, like, so it's, I don't think, you can't clone the soul, can you? Like, these clones, they want the same soul, or were they? I don't know. That's crazy. That's insane. Sarah's dead. But, now there's a clone, Sarah. Um... I, did, I enjoyed the episode overall, it was pretty fun episode, I love seeing the beginning bit with like Constantine just being annoyed at everyone in his house, because yeah, they, that's the, the legends are incredibly annoying, <laughs> like they're funny to watch, but if you actually had to deal with them in real life, I imagine they would probably drive you insane. And like, for the first part of the episode, I was wondering why Constantine just isn't telling them about his loss of magic, and you know, it was like, I, in the back of my head I'm thinking, oh please tell me this isn't going to be like another one of those things from like, that you'd have in like a Arrow or Flash or Supergirl Legend show, it's like someone's got a secret that they should tell everyone but they don't because reasons, because stupid character writing, and I was literally thinking, I was like, oh man, I forgot Superman and Lois doesn't have this, so I, I, he was like, oh, we've got to deal with this again, but then he did make a good point, which is that he doesn't want people on Earth and below Earth knowing that he's powerless, which is the fair point for John Constantine, because I imagine there's quite a lot of people who, if they found out, would like to take advantage of that information.
the main part of the episode was the uh, mil- uh, heart vampire alien thing um, being dealing with her. Which, I mean, the, the actual alien design, that was pretty cool. I am liking most of the alien designs that we've seen so far. They've been pretty cool. And they've been mostly practical as well, so that's, that's always cool to see. There was one moment that I realized, like, Ava started, like, shaking Amelia heart and, like, questioning stuff. I was like, Ava, you know they ma- she, that this alien massacred the town. Why are you doing this? I don't know. That, that, for some reason, that annoyed me. I don't know why. Mick and the alien hooked up, which I think is the least surprising thing I've ever seen in the show. I'm pretty sure every person on Earth saw that coming. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's a pretty huge episode, actually. If that's revealed, that's the original Sarah, you know, she's dead. She's... That's pretty huge. If you like this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you later.